Valentina Floy and I'm here today to introduce you to my 10 essential things that are always with me. Number one, it's my guitar. Well, you probably have seen her many times with me in the, I guess in my socials and stuff like that. But I don't think I w what like I don't think that I could be without my guitar. I don't know what I would do without her. So yeah, my guitar. And uh, that's how I start writing every song. So yeah, this is number one. Number two! This one is my diary that I'm writing at the moment. I just write down like every single thing that comes in my head. Sometimes I just write notes, sometimes I just write lyrics, but sometimes I just journal in it, sometimes I draw stupid things like that. This is um, another thing that I always have with me. This is a small one, then I have like bigger ones at home, but my little diary for sure. And it's blue, my favorite color. So number three, another one um, of the things that I often have with me, not all, all the time, but banana choco candies. I've been eating this since I was a kid. I'm mean, so good. It's like banana with chocolate in it. And it's very nice. Nothing special, but just my phone. I feel like obviously it's always with me and especially because I have apps such as like Spotify and Apple Music and all of those platforms where I can just listen to music. So yeah, this is pretty essential in my everyday life and I work with it as well. I love to take pictures, so <laughs> I do that with my phone as well. And yeah, this is my phone. Then the next one is... This is like um, another thing that I really really love. I, I really love this thing and it's my film camera. It's called Carlita. I gave her a name. And yeah, she's very cute. I'm going to take a picture. Yeah! <laughs> so this is Carlita. And uh, my film camera with which I take a lot of film pictures. Ta -da! This is my favorite book that I have read it already, obviously. It's called Tuesdays with Mori. But I feel like this book has saved me in like so many situations and I feel like I always go back to it and I always try and remember the things that I've learned from it when I'm in the time of my life where I'm a bit like lost or like stressed and I it's like yeah it has some very wise stuff in it and I think it's very nice so this is one of my favorite books and it's called Tuesdays with Maury this is literally, I, I don't know why I didn't show it as my number one, but probably this is my number one together with my phone. I don't think I can live without this, like another part of my body. I always get on the motorbike as well in Bangkok and I feel like everything I do, even when I walk in the streets, I have to have like my earphones in my ears and listen to music. That gives me, you know, confidence and power and like, nice. So yeah, my earphones, I love them so much. Mwah. The next thing is this one. It's just a normal hair band. Like normally I never do my hair. Actually I confess this morning I also didn't do my hair. So it was a bit psycho. But like, yeah. And I go on the bike a lot. So I just need this thing to tie my hair up. And then also when I go to the beach, I feel like it's so cute. It has flowers. So you know, so it makes me feel like I'm in Hawaii. <laughs> so yeah, my hair band with flowers. Dun, 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 dun. This, my mascara. <laughs> I just love mascaras because I feel like I'm a little bit obsessed with eyelashes, as you can see. Like, I like to have them very long and black and curved up like that. So yeah, I think an essential, like in makeup and stuff like that, that I really need to have is mascara and I just take it around with me. And this one is pretty cute and vegan. Okay, so now I think we got to the last item, number 10 of my essentials. And this one is a little bit sentimental, so I left it like at the end. But basically, this thing has been like my lucky charm since like 6-7 years ago. Because it was a time that was a bit sad for me and I've lost someone very special, like a very close person to me. And I was like super sad, super stressed, blah, blah, blah. And then I remember I was sitting like on a beach and I had my hands in the sand and I was just like playing with the sand and all of a sudden I find this like little Buddha in my hand so yeah I think it's a very special thing that I always keep with me and it's like my super absolute lucky charm and it's like an ancient Buddha Luang Po To Luang Po something like that 
I think. But it's a bit consumed and old, so you cannot really see like what it says behind and exactly the figure. But yeah, it's a very special thing and I believe it will bring me good luck. So yeah, these were like the 10 essentials for today and like 10 items that are very special to me and that are mostly all the time with me. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you so much. I'll see you around. Bye!